I'm Mike Berger, the editor of LBM Journal, and we're here at the 2024 NAHB International Builders Show. Now, anybody who's in this industry knows that water is the nemesis of any kind of structure. And more and more, codes are requiring water-resistant barriers to better deal with water infiltration. That's why we're here at Huber Engineered Woods to talk about rain screen. So we announced this product at IBS last year, uh, and we've recently launched nationally on January 1st of this year. Right. So this is our new Zip System rain screen product, okay? okay? Um, has a polyethylene mesh on the back side of it. So this product provides you a quarter inch gap against the wall to separate your cladding from your sheathing to allow any moisture that gets behind here to drain down gotcha. and air to come up through to drain that to dry that moisture out. So what we're trying to uh, show here is that you can see water at the top of the wall up here and we're showing that space, that quarter inch space and showing that water going behind the rain screen against our sheathing and draining down, right? We created that space, that water's draining all the way down the wall. And what's that also gonna do is once that water stops or that moisture's done, it's gonna allow air to come up through the bottom and travel all the way up through the top of your wall's cavity to dry out that moisture, right? We want water away, we don't want water sitting there, we want that moisture gone. This is gonna serve basically like a, a, a secondary layer of protection against what's already there with the green board that's there. That's it, so the green board, the, the zip board is your primary w, uh, WRB. Mm -hmm. That's where you're flashing your windows, your doors to. What we've done is we're, we're giving you a space, we're giving you separation between your cladding but it also has an integrated WRB in this too as well. Right. So we're doing everything we can to keep that moisture away from your sheathing. And you can actually see that right here on the side with the water that's bouncing off. You notice that it's not actually penetrating the rain screen product. It's on the outside and it's draining down as well.